Shalom and welcome to a series of classes and meditations that are going to introduce you to the Siddur in a way that you've never experienced it. Most people don't realize that the Siddur is actually a manual which guides you through five different levels of which you and all human beings are made. The nefesh, which is your bodily vitality and your real reality in this physical world. The ruach, which is your emotional life, where you experience love, compassion, fear, excitement, joy. The realm of neshama, which is where you're able to access the unity which stands behind all of the different phenomena of life so that you are there able to discover that there's one who stands behind and within all. And then the level of Chaya, which is the universal life force, which is a way of describing how there's a pulse which is going through all of existence and creation, which is actually moving it towards its purpose with ideals and with intentions and getting in touch with that is when you begin to feel the pulse of a more transcendent aspect of yourself where you're getting uh, information and enlightenment and inspiration for your purpose and values in life. And then finally, the level of Yechida, which is the level of your soul, which is an ongoing and unending contact with the singular divine presence in which your complete devotion to Hashem is something which is present, real, and palpable. Those five levels, you'll be surprised to hear, are actually the five station ways of the Sidur which we're going to be exploring as we move through Birkot HaShachar and Pesuket de Zimra, Shema Yisrael, the Shmon Esre, and Tachanun. We'll discover that each of these is actually designed to awaken these aspects of us and for us then to utilize those awakenings for furthering the purposes of our lives and of what Hashem Barach wants for there to be in this world. So it's exciting for me to be able to share this knowledge and these meditations with you. And each class will be approximately four or five minutes of uh, information about the different aspects of what's in the Siddur. And then each class will be accompanied by a meditation which will be designed to guide you into the state and into the experience of what it is that that station way along this path is meant to awaken in you. So I'm looking forward to sharing this with you and for us traveling together on this daily journey that the Siddur guides. Welcome. Welcome to this meditation, which will take you through the five different levels of which you are composed, which are the very same levels through which the Siddur guides us. And so make yourself comfortable for this brief journey, awakening these different aspects of yourself. Begin by taking a nice deep breath through your nostrils. Follow it in as your stomach expands. Sense how your entire body expands as the air comes in. Feel everything opening up, welcoming this life force as it fills you. Sense how the feet on your ground are so simply supported. How the weight of your body is supported by the surface beneath you. How your body itself asserts a presence in the space of creation that's a vortex of life as it flows around you and through you, forming into this physical being. 
sense the blessedness of that, the blessedness of your power to live. The sharing of Hashem of his existence and your ability to know, be conscious, your physicality able to sense, see, taste, move. Ah, Baruch Atah Hashem. Sense how the boundaries of your body provide you with a dwelling place here in this world. And yet, that bounded body is a small part of the all of the vitality of life which fills this universe. Invite yourself to appreciate how vast is the presence of all that is and how deeply you desire to participate in the life beyond the boundedness of your individual presence. Intensify your sense of desire, expansive presence. yearning for participation in the all of life. And now I invite you to return to a sense of the boundaries of your own body and the appreciation of what they give you. As you place the palm of your right hand on your heart and your left hand on top of that right hand, warming the area that is the center for the life force that is within you and the emotions which you experience as you touch the world of Ruach. Appreciate the beauty of the life which surrounds you and perhaps bring up a memory of a beautiful place that is so attractive to you. It makes you feel appreciative of the divine compassion of creating a world that is so full of beautiful and attractive things. If it's a place where the sun is shining, let it shine brightly. If there are trees, water flowing, flowers, imagine them in their fullness and allow yourself to enjoy so so directly and simply the sensations of this beauty. Perhaps populate this place with a person or a few people who indeed you feel love towards.
Let that love open up in your heart now. Appreciate Hashem's gift to you of this opportunity to experience embodied emotion. Hallelujah. I'm so excitedly and enlightenedly in praise of you, Hashem. Breathe in now, air as or a light filling the entirety of your emotional system, intensifying the feeling of love, compassion, appreciation of beauty. And now, place your hands back where they were previously and tilt your head slightly upward as if you're gazing towards a single source of all. Allow that gaze to Intensify as if you're looking towards a light shining down upon your face. A single light. Shining forth to all who dwell in the earth. One single source one single intelligence, one single awareness, filling all with knowledge, filling all with consciousness, allowing that awareness to sense the oneness of all that is. Your neshama knows Shema Yisrael. Adonai Eloheinu. Adonai Echad. The one who brings all into being is one. All the being is one. All that is, is one. Since your heart now informing this vision of unity with the desire that it be known by all, it be lived with wisdom, with yearning towards it, with full filling of any lack, with forgiveness and kindness. the fullness of the desire for clarity of identity and boundaries, for healing and harmony, for all the resources of wealth, friendship, guidance, joy, flowing down towards you and up from your heart, flowing in through your face and through the crown of your head. Compassion, care, 
openness, awakeness into your heart and then nearly spoken as prayer. Chaya, full life with its passion and devotion, purpose and meaning. Awaken your heart to yearn for one of these aspects of Hashem's desires for this world, which are your desire. And now just give yourself over to the one as your embodied boundaries seem to dissipate and disappear as you merge to the simple presence of the one Yechida, the only one. And now we'll begin to return to a joyous sense of Hashem filling you with desire for the goodness of this world. The sense of his glowing glance towards you, filling you with the knowledge of the one. And back to an appreciation of the beauty of life and what is here. Imagining again the place you imagined earlier. Feeling the love and compassion of Hashem who made it. And your love and compassion for him. And finally, back to the body your pulsing heart, its weight on the surface upon which you sit, your feet on the ground, your life force flowing through you. Take a nice breath in as you incorporate and integrate the five levels where you have been. Blessings to you. Blessings to us all. Blessings to this world. Baruch Atah Hashem.